Hello everyone, welcome back to another FSD beta video. We are on version 11.4.4 and we are doing complex left turns today. So as uh, I did the test with 4.3, there was uh, a lot of good uh, good situations or good scenarios in the way it did it. But uh, I'm interested to see in 4.4 if there's any differences. Right now my, my steering wheel is glitching and it can't really get out of this parking lot so I'm just going to help it out. Alright, All right. very slow start for FSD, but let's see how it goes. So yeah, if you like these videos, please hit like and please subscribe to my channel, it'll help me a lot. There's a stop sign. It's freaking out just a bit because of that person. Coming out of that truck, it's clear to go. Okay, and here's our first uh, complex left turn. So we have a stop sign here. We have a little bit of an occluded vision because of that sign over there on the left uh, that, that is kind of blocking our view on our left-hand side. But um, yeah, this, this one is a little bit of high traffic. So the cars coming in from the right-hand side are coming in at probably like around 80 kilometers an hour. I don't know, that's, that, that's probably like around 60, 60 miles per hour. Okay, so should stop here. There's cars coming in from our left. It's pretty busy to be honest. It is lunchtime. Let's see, you should be able to commit for this. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. It should stop here at Binion. I'm getting honked at, but seems clear. Alright, that was that was really a struggle. So what happened over there was kind of anticipating there's a median that it can't stop at but wasn't really sure so it kept going back and forth back and forth and um, at the meantime the traffic coming in from the left hand side the cars were kind of gushing in and they were getting closer and closer so someone was honking at us because the car was not clearing the path so I was I was in control over there I would have pushed the car a little bit further but I can I can sense that the car is going to make the stop in the median and that's and since the car is slowing down our left-hand side, ideally I wouldn't be driving in that situation. And here we go, we're going too fast for this hump over here. Let me circle around and we'll do this again. That was pretty interesting. Okay, here we go again. We're stopping at the stop sign. It's creeping forward for visibility here. There we go. And it's clear we should be able to go, so there's a commit. Okay, and here we go again. This one particularly is a little bit difficult just because of the median is not really actually highlighted over there. And it doesn't really anticipate that it could stop just because of the way the, the median is designed over here. But, and look at that, awesome. Now we are a little bit too, yeah, there we go. A little bit too, it doesn't really get into the median properly over there just because of the way the pavement's designed. But uh, yeah, that was a good one. Another stop in the median, and uh, there was no traffic coming in from the left-hand side, so it was a little bit less, um, less, uh, you know, of a stressful situation for FSD there. Let's see how it does on this unprotected left. We'll do one more turn. Let's just watch how it does this. This is pretty interesting. There's a lot of traffic coming in. A lot of incoming traffic here. Uh, there should be a gap. There is a gap behind that truck. Let's see if it takes it. Yeah, and get the commit. There's the commit. And it should really step on it over here. And it does. Very nice. Okay. Great job. There is a there's a speed camera over there. That's why everyone's kind of slowing down. <laughs> That's why everybody's slowing down over there. That's pretty funny. All right, I'll circle around and uh, we'll set you up for another another unprotected left. These are very interesting. I find them. I don't know if uh, you folks like find these tests interesting. Please let me know in the comments section below. Thank you very much for watching and liking my video and subscribing as well for sure. Thanks.
Okay, here we go. So we stopped. Should be clear to go now. <clears throat> There's quite some traffic in front of us, uh, ahead of us. So let's see how it goes. I'll have to skip you guys forward a bit. So it is clear right now on the left. There are cars coming though. As we can see them coming by now. Now there is a turn over there. So the cars are... Okay, it's going to stop now for that. Because the first two lanes, if you can see, notice here on the, on the intersection, the first two lanes are cars that are going straight. And then the right one is where people are turning in. So we are good to go if they go through that. We are kind of on the extreme forward right now. I won't let it go forward anymore, to be honest. Just cause that's gonna put our nose really to the front of the, into the streets. It does see way better than I do, to be honest. Just cause, a little bit of a nudge there, but another nudge. We should be clear to go here. Okay, it's not gonna commit. It, it finds it to be it can't get too aggressive over here because it still doesn't understand where it's going to map itself on the median. Let's see if it goes after this car. No, it doesn't. It's going to wait for one more car. Are we going to get to commit? We're going to start getting honked at. Okay, this is the white car. This last, this is the last car literally, so we should be able to go forward. And then I'm just going to pull up the camera over here. And as you can see, the first lane is free and we kind of merge through. That's, okay, that was really good. It, it, it kind of like went on, eared on the side of like, uh, wanted to do like a very smooth and, and continuous flowing maneuver, which I understand. Like I'd rather do that than stop in a median and, and do the whole check and all that stuff. So we're slowing down here for traffic, for the speed. And there is a camera, camera car on our left hand side so okay so the other thing on uh, my settings I'm I'm currently on my autopilot settings I'm on assertive and uh, I've got it I've got the speed indicator down to zero Delta so uh, we're going exactly the speed limit over here all right so I'll set us up for the next uh, complex turn over here at the Peace uh, Peace River Bridge and then we'll uh, uh, and 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 I'll set you I'll tune you back guys again. All right, that wasn't really good. Uh, unprotected left over there. It kind of drove in front of a, a car and it was really creeping forward uh, kind of behavior. So I had to punch the accelerator there a little bit. A lot of, uh, a lot of jittering here for the, for the steering wheel. All right. All right, so this is the left turn coming up to our unprotected left turn, scenario number two over here. This is our first try, let's see how it goes. Sees a stop sign, stops, kind of takes a center, center kind of location over here for this, for this maneuver. There are cars coming up on her left hand side, but it's occluded by that parked bus to be honest oh and it kind of makes it makes a smooth and a very very aggressive and assertive um, maneuver there very nice okay we'll circle around and we'll do this again now there is a lot of traffic that is actually occluding our view on our left hand side I'll uh, try and take a picture of that and I'll pull uh, and I'll pull it up here on the on the feed uh, while editing so that you guys can see what I'm talking about
going to get a little bit closer here to this car behind. Just gonna punch it over here. There's a lot of traffic behind me that we're holding up. Right, so does this turn very awkwardly over here, so um, there is a person right behind me, so I'm kind of wary about that. Ooh, and here we go, there's a incoming car. Let's see if it handles this well. Wow, look at that. Look how close we got to that car. And we didn't even fold our mirrors. <laughs> 4.4 is really good with uh, getting close to cars, to be honest. And some pedestrian over here is going to stop for them. I'm going to disengage. I don't know. I don't know why it does this. So I'm going to engage again over here and let's see how it goes. So you can see this is what I'm talking about. And a smooth sailing one. Okay. Nice commit. I really like those commits. I took a picture, but it's blurry. <laughs> I'm going to have to circle around. There was a car behind me as well, so I didn't want to overdo it. But I'll take, I'll try and take another picture again at that intersection so that you can understand how, how occluded our view is. And you really have to get into the intersection to get a good, good view of the incoming traffic. This one should be a smooth sailing one. Oh, none of these unprotected lefts are doing good, to be honest, this time around. Slows down for this mechanic or technician. <coughs> Construction worker. Okay, I'll fast for forward you through this boring part over here just to get you up to the unprotected left again. All right, here's our wonky looking stop. It doesn't think that there's incoming cars on the other side, that's the issue. So it's cutting across the traffic and there's no lane marking. So it's very difficult for it to realize it's a two way. All right, <laughs> it took us like a lot of swerving to get into the beginning of this intersection, but Let's see how it goes. Okay, here's the stop. It's gonna stop for and then it's gonna creep forward. Yep, and it's clear. Once it's clear, it just commits. So I took a picture of that and uh, you can see it up here. So. Yeah, we'll probably do one last one and uh, hopefully we'll see if there's any any new scenarios there we can uh, take out of it. But, uh, but yeah, this is pretty much it. Like it does the it does the unprotected left very well. It's just um, when there's no traffic. But when there is traffic, it's uh, kind of all over the place. And, um, and especially when there's pedestrian. Like that pedestrian was crossing and uh, for some reason it just didn't want to. It still wanted to creep forward gets a good glance of incoming traffic on this unprotected left and goes through it that was done very nicely but that was just a lucky shot to be honest <clears throat> all right i'll fast forward you do through this section over here oh that's a lot of jerkiness that's a lot of steering wheel jerk nobody drives like this All right, so here's the stop again at this uh, just before our turn, and it's doing the same issue again, where it's really crossing into the encroaching into the incoming lane, which is unsafe. <clears throat> All right, let's see how this goes. Wow, this time we're really stopping, like at where the stop sign is. It's gonna creep forward a little bit. It can see, it can start seeing cars over there. There is a car that is turning into our lane as well. I can see the indicator from here. Oh, it's just changing lanes. And 
now there's a pedestrian that's crossing, but they're gonna cross behind us. And this is this is a normal situation where you know you take a little bit longer than you actually need to, so pedestrians have to cross behind you. No doubt. Okay, so let's see if we're gonna go into the. Yeah, we're gonna. Okay, the, there's a car coming in to our lane, but I wasn't sure about that. Let's see if we're gonna go. I think we're gonna land in the median. I'm gonna pull up my backup camera over here. And yeah, here we go. Should stop. All right. And we're clearly in a very good position over here, and it and it's not going forward or or backwards or anything. So this is really really good. Now that it's clear, it should be able to commit. It was gonna wait for the other car as well to clear, so two lanes to clear, and then it's gonna go ahead. All right. Well, I guess that's that's fair enough. All right, folks. There you have it. Uh, this was a really good one. I really enjoyed this test. Uh, Thank you so much for watching if you have been watching so far and uh, please hit that like button and please subscribe to my channel. I really, really enjoy making these and uh, really enjoy the engagement in the comment section below. Um, please don't be, uh, don't be shy to leave me any comment. I take uh, any, any criticism to be honest and I just want to improve my videos and make it more watchable so please do let me know thank you so much for watching and uh yeah we'll see you in the next one 4.4 everybody it's re it's a really good release really enjoying this one thank you so much bye